Hi, welcome to the solutions manual. In this video, we will solve the problem 5 41 from RC Propeller Engineering Static 12 edition. According to this problem, we have to determine the horizontal and vertical components of reaction at the pin A and the reaction of the smooth collar B on the rod. To solve this problem, first of all, we have to draw all the support reactions. So at point A, I have a pin connection. For the pin connection, I have one horizontal reaction and one vertical reaction. So I consider these directions for the reaction. Let's call this AY and this one AX. Now I have another support of the color D. So for the smooth color at D, I can slide this color up and down so there is no reaction in the vertical direction but I cannot pull this color in the horizontal direction so a reaction is generated in the horizontal direction let's call this NB also since it is a pin connection so the movement is also allowed so I have only one reaction at this color that is NB because the movement is only restricted in the horizontal direction. Ok, now to further solve this problem, we have to use the equations of equilibrium. So I have, I have first equation which, which is sum of the forces in the x direction equal to 0. I am considering right hand side as positive. I have AX minus NB equals to 0. I have AX equals to NB. Let's call this equation 1. Similarly, I have another equation which is sum of the forces in the y direction equal to 0. I am considering up direction as positive. So I have AY minus 300 minus 450 equals to 0. So Ay is equals to 750 LBs. Now we have in total we had three unknown variables Ax, Ay and Nb but we had only two equations so we need one more equation. Our third equation will be sum of the moments at point A because it has the maximum number of unknown reactions equals to 0. I am considering clockwise moment as positive. This AX and AY reaction forces will not generate any moment about point A because they are passing through it. So there is no moment arm. This 300 force, 300 LD force is trying to rotate the assembly in clockwise direction so it is taken as positive 300 into the moment arm which is this one fit also this 450 LB is producing the clockwise moment so it is also positive 450 the moment arm now is one fit plus this two fit so in total three fit now this for this MB Reaction. This NB reaction is trying to rotate the assembly in anti clockwise direction, so it is taken as negative. Now, for the moment arm, the moment arm is the perpendicular distance from the line of action of force. So, I have to find this distance, this perpendicular distance. Now, this perpendicular distance is 4 sin 30. equals to 0. From here, if you simplify it, NB is equal to 8 to 5 LBs. This is our second answer. And if you put this in equation 1, then from here, AX is equal to 825 LBs.
This is the answer to this problem. I hope you will find this video helpful. If you do, please don't forget to subscribe to this channel and also turn on the bell icon for the daily updates. And if you have any question about this problem, then you can ask them in the comment section and I will answer it as soon as possible. Thank you.